Today, I got a collab that I wanted to talk to you about, and it is Million on Mars and Sunflower Land. You may have seen Million on Mars on my channel before, and it's a great time to get into it. If you haven't started, the collab is going to be great, and it has started. When you get this video, you're going to be able to jump in and start getting golden sunflower seeds right away. In fact, it probably started the day before you're seeing this video. So make sure you're logging in to go ahead and grab them. If you are not part of Million on Mars already, that's okay. I got something for you. Welcome everybody, I'm Kevin Smack and I'm not a financial advisor, I'm a gamer. And we're gonna talk about this collaboration going on between Millions on Mars and Sunflower Land. To start, we do have a giveaway. If you are new to Million on Mars, we are gonna be giving some of these away. Just do me a favor and go ahead and comment down below why you want to play Million on Mars. Go into my Discord channel under Million on Mars giveaway and just put your YouTube name and your wallet address. We'll go ahead and pick some people to go ahead and give these out to. Just remember this is for only for brand new people entering the game, not ones that are already playing. With that said, when you go ahead and get into Millions on Mars, you're going to get a golden sunflower seed now every day for 14 days. So you'll be able to get up to 14 of them and you can spend them on things. So you can see here they do have a nice little guide you can click into and read all about it. And we'll go ahead and look at that guide real quick just to give you an idea of what's going on. And as we go through here, it says how to get started. Basically, you will get be able to claim a golden sunflower when you get your daily rations. Once you have that, you can save that up and then you can start purchasing things. So this is what we're looking at. You're gonna have 14 days and you can use one for two full power cells, for example, or you could save up 10 of them and get a rare solar panel. That's probably what I'm looking at at the moment. I'm still kind of trying to decide. And there are some other things, mine and rover pack, that actually wouldn't be too bad either. And yeah, you can go ahead and take a look, see what you want. They even have land in here. And also you can get the seeds and grow them too. So if you do grow them, you can then exchange them, the sunflower seeds, the regular ones will turn into sunflowers. And you can also purchase things here, like that you see on the screen here. So there's a lot of different rewards you can get from this crossover event. So sunflowers are going to be growing on Mars. You can get this cool badge as well. And it's cool because they have crossovers going from one game to the other and vice versa. So you can start something in Million on Mars and end in Sunflower Land. And then for Sunflower Land, Melon Dusk has crash landed his rocket in Sunflower Land and needs players to help to gather items to fix his rocket to take him back home to Mars. So make sure you go ahead and check that out. Sunflower Land is on the Polygon network, so it is going to be using Matix, and it does look like an amazing game. I haven't played it myself. I have read over the white paper, though, before this video, and it looks like something I'd probably be interested in because it's some nice farming techniques and you're growing plants and everything, and I really like the idea behind it. They have a lot of good stuff with the tokenomics. I was very impressed with that. With the tokenomics, for example, as if the game does well, they do well, is basically the idea of it. But you can read it and break it down more. But basically, on Millions on Mars, a rocket carrying glorious sunflower seeds from the sunflower lands has crashed and scattered special sunflower seeds all over the planet Mars. Dive into multi-day crafting quests to collect seeds and unlock special items and be handsomely rewarded for your work. So from the crossover from Sunflower, you just head over to the Goblin Village, start by heading there, look for the crashed rocket, and that'll get you started on that area. And we already talked about Million on Mars, basically log on, and then you'll start collecting these seeds. And with this scavenging, you can scavenge to find extra sunflower seeds across the surface of Mars. Once the player has collected three golden sunflowers, they can trade them. You have all the details on here. If you want to take a look at that, just pause it there. Really cool event. It's nice to see two games come together and, you know, add some story and some game functionality between the two. 
I do want to definitely thank them for sponsoring this video. I'm excited to dive in. Let me know what you are going to be targeting for your golden sunflower rewards. I would like to have a better idea what everyone's going for. I, I really think it's between the rare solar panels or the mine and rover pack. So those are my ideas there. I feel like the rare is going to go pretty quick, though. There's only a thousand. However, land would be nice, too. All the links for both games down below if you do want to check it out and get a better idea. And this is Sunflower Land. Just to give you a quick look of how this is working it is like a 3D game where you walk around. Pretty cool. And also one last thing with Millions on Mars, they do have Meet the Martisans, which is a neat little spinoff on Solana. So you can purchase these art NFTs and pretty cool. All unique, there's 10,000 total, and it looks like they have been selling very well. So if you are interested in that, make sure you get in on that before they sell out because it looks like they're selling out pretty quickly. And thanks for the view.